I just won't touch anything. That's all. I don't need to. Well, I need to see the chat if anyone comes in here. My bed's not made. Too bad. I don't need a filter anyway. Yes. So um, I'm waiting for my uh, food. I did not order Chinese. I ordered souvlaki. I like the. Uh, sorry. I like the um, the the skewers, the sticks of souvlaki. Yum yum. Well, I'm feeling a little shy, feeling a little nervous about the live chat tomorrow. There's nobody in here, so it's fine. I don't have to be nervous. It's good. It's good. It's going to take a while. It's because they ask for my phone number. The restaurant asks for my phone number. And there's no doorbell outside. Stop clapping. There's no doorbell outside the door. What happened? Oh, somebody's here. Hi, are you? Oh, it's Audrey. Is little Samuel Wade with you? Hi, Sam. Uh, am I allowed to call him Sammy W? Hello, Samuel Wade. And mom and dad and whoever's there. Oh, my lips hurt. What was I saying? Yes. I give them my phone number. But I always have my phone on silent. And sometimes they text me because they're outside. And then sometimes I answer, I see a food guy and I answer the door, but it's not food for me. It's food for someone else. And then that's kind of awkward. I'm going to start listening to Brass Bound Trunk today. LOL, sure. He's teething. Not a lot of fun. Oh, not a lot of fun for anyone. <laughs> He's so cute. Um, you're going to start listening to it. Well, how long is a book? Is the book? I don't know. Somebody asked me if I could put all the chapters together and do it in one video. Oh no, my phone could handle that. Right now, I don't have my microphone in my laptop, so I am doing everything on my phone, and I have like this much space. Sometimes I go to save my video. You were talking and. I didn't see your messages went away. Hold on. Live chat. I Hello, Night Owl. Wow, there's three people in here. How do I make this go away so I don't have to look at it? I mean, I want to look at your um, chat, but all this, all these options show up on the screen and I, it's covering my, fa my face and I can't see if I'm like doing something stupid. Um, hello. So I cannot, I have to do it chapter by chapter. Okay. Everything fades out. I think when somebody does a chat message, it pops up and then eventually it fades out. Yes. No, it just, oh, I'm working in the kitchen doing meal prep this afternoon. So I should be able to listen to the, I didn't get to finish reading it, it faded away. Apparently, there's a lot of little intricacies with this uh, um, YouTube. It's very confusing. Uh, oh, okay. Good. I hope you enjoy it. Um, it's going to be fun to compare the two books. Oh, I don't have the original text, Brass Bound Trunk, with me. That is at my parents' house with my everything. I keep looking out the window. I mean, it's a Saturday night and they're busy and it's gonna take a while, but I'm paranoid like that, I guess. Right. Don't mind my hair. I'll try to make it look cuter tomorrow. So there's three people in here. There's Audrey, there's Night Owl, and there's some lurker who's not, no, I think that's me. I think the third person's me. No, it's not because it said zero. And then who are you, third person? Please say hello. Mm. So what have I got on my desk here? 
Um, oh, I have another mug. This has strawberry tea in it. I've got it. This is uh, the Little Mermaid. LOL, the hair is a work of art. I mean, a work in progress. It will be beautiful very soon. Thank you. Um, come on, third person. Fess up. Seriously, I keep hearing the door. Excuse me. Don't look at my bed. No, there's nothing there. Um, so I... I'm trying to be gentle with it. I have some good stuff to use. I still have this. When in the next chapter of the 13th Pearl out? Sorry if this sounds impatient. No, it's okay. It's because I don't have the book with me. I am supposed to be going back to my parents on May 5th. So maybe May 5th or May 6th. Chapter 12, I think we're on chapter 12 of the 13th Pearl, I will record. I'm so looking forward to it. I'm so looking forward to recording with my microphone again. <sighs> Thank you. I'm glad everyone understands. Because I don't like having a bunch of books in progress. Normally, I wouldn't want to do that. I just want one of the original books and one of the Nancy Drew Files books to be going at the same time. Plus, I still have all those other books to finish, like the Bobsy Twins, Hugh Pine, Anne of Green Gables. Oh, I love that Anne of Green Gables storybook. It's so fun. I'm really, I was really having fun recording that. Hi, uh, J Jada, Jada, Deaton, Jada. Hello. This is exciting. It's fun. People are coming in here. <laughs> um, yes, this is my Little Mermaid mug. This is my favorite channel. Oh, you are Soul Surgeon. Thank you. That's so cool. I got this in 1993 at Walt Disney World. It's my Little Mermaid mug. Um, yeah, Olaplex. Would you like to see two little baby chickens? I can show you some of my knitting, okay? Here is some kind of duck guy. He... Well, he has duck feet. I guess he's a duck. What do you think? I would love to see the rest of the Sweet Valley High book recorded. Oh, the Sweet Valley High, the out to sea one where they're stranded on a desert island. I did finish it. Some of the chapters were removed because of copyright. And I was, I had a ton of Sweet Valley High books, but I was kind of just like, babysitting them for a friend for a while and I thought I was going to have access to them for a long time and then she was like okay I want my books back um plus yeah with the copyright I don't want to spend a lot of time recording and you know uploading just to have them removed that's not cool plus I really I want to stick to one thing you know I I do have some Hardy Boys books now but I need to stick to Nancy Drew because there's a lot I want to read, but it would just get too cluttered and everything. The door weighs a hundred pounds. Yes, I'll look for it. Look for what? I forgot what I was talking about. What are you copyright? Ugh. There should be an option so that I can decide when. The chat goes off the screen. Read the password to Larkspur Lane, please. Oh, gosh. I'm going to. Um, I'm going to read everything eventually. I already have a few lined up. After we finish the 13th Pearl, I'll be, I'll be starting uh, The Secret in the Old Attic, revised text, which I'm reading for the first time myself. I'm on chapter 15, I think, and I love it. It is in my top five now. 
some of the books it takes a while to get into it or you're like man I don't really like this part but the whole thing is really fun I love the whole um spooky mansion thing and there's like a music element and um it's fun so okay jasmine tea is very drying in my mouth like it makes me feel parched i'm gonna need to drink water at the same time if you guys notice that i say like a lot please slap me silly What's your favorite, Nancy Drew? Gosh. I haven't read all of them yet. And there are some I read when I was a kid that I don't really remember. Sometimes I just remember the cover and I don't remember what happens in the book. Um, some of my favorites are so, uh, the Twisted Candle one I like a lot. Uh, I like The Crumbling Wall. Everybody's gone. Wait, it says zero people. You ask me a question and then you leave. <laughs> I wonder how much battery I have actually. I'm not plugged in. Um, and my phone battery is very unpredictable. By the way, when the guy comes, I get all flustered. I'm like, I gotta hurry. <laughs> so I'm just gonna leave you here. I'm, but I will come back. Okay, good, because it says zero people are here, are here. Maybe it has to auto refresh or something. So I like, um, I need to kind of look at them. I can tell you what covers I love. <laughs> Mystery at Lilac Inn is a cover I love. Um, I should write things down and have a list of my favorites. YouTube lies. Mm -hmm. I don't like that. Oh, right. Two baby chickens. There were three originally. I made three, but somebody bought one of them. Does anyone remember um, Garfield and Friends, the Saturday morning cartoon? They had Garfield and then there was us acres with orson the pig and it took place on a farm and there was a little chicken guy his name was booker well the shape of these guys reminds me of booker only booker had little tiny black dot eyes and he hung out with sheldon who was a chicken who was still an egg like his his um his legs and feet came out of the egg but he was in the egg. <laughs> anyway, and let me show you. Oh, my favorite is Larkspur Lane. Oh, yeah. I'm not a big fan of the 99 Steps cover, but I really enjoyed the book. It was fun. Let me show you this. This is a doll that is not finished. She has a bald spot. She has alopecia areata, just like I do. Anyway, she started out as a Nancy Drew doll, and well, I guess she's still going to be Nancy Drew. I have so many dolls and things that are in progress. I didn't put enough stuffing in her. She's kind of a flop rag doll. And this yarn is amazing. It, it actually looks like hair. Is there a way to make this focus? Okay, I'm going to touch the screen. Weird, it does like a little puddle thing. Is she, is the art challenge still on? It is, I have five entries so far. My food's here. I think, oh, I'm coming, I'll be back. Ouch.
I'm here. Oops. I'm here. I'm here. That made me think of the uh, Pee Wee's Big Adventure. Can you hear me? Pee Wee's Big Adventure. When he goes to see his, uh, well, there's still four people in here. I got souvlaki, skewers, brochettes. Is that a brochette? Like a shish kebab. Um, and I got mini pogos. Pogos are what Americans call corn dogs. In Canada, pogo is a brand. But if you go to a restaurant and you ask for a corn dog, well, some people know what you mean, but on the menu, it actually says Pogo. It's like Kleenex. Even if you're using um, a different brand, not Kleenex, everyone still calls it Kleenex. Thank you, you guys, for joining me for this practice. And I hope that you can come back tomorrow. And if I didn't answer your questions, I didn't know what Pogos were. Yeah, that's what Pogos Oh, also in the 50s or something, right? It was like a pogo stick that you would go up and down on. <laughs> anyway, I'm very excited to eat, so I'll have to leave you now. Thank you for joining me. And if I didn't answer your question that you asked, anyone asked a question and I didn't answer it? Sorry? Bye, everyone. Say bye. Wait, I want you to see everything over there. <laughs> bye. Uh, that's funny. Thank you. Enjoy your supper. Thank you. I will. Ooh. You ever get really excited about food? Also, I wasn't sure. Well, right. I asked you guys if I want, if I should have Chinese or Greek. And I also really wanted sushi. But I have the, I always get like, you know, you get into a routine. Like I always order the same order from the same restaurant. You know what I mean. Okay. Bye.